Welcome again to Business Equity and Opportunities, a favorite segment, if I'm being honest, for the success story. Renee Kelly, a certified personal trainer and bodybuilder. She's on a mission to help other women get fit and stay healthy, and she's found some unique ways to motivate. This is Business Equity and Opportunities, success story. Well, my name is Renee Kelly. I am a fitness trainer. Uh, I'm the owner of Fit with Renee. It's a personal training studio. Uh, my focus is women, women's health, and making sure that they understand nutrition and how to train their bodies pro properly. It started some years ago, just, uh, you know, my mom had passed away at an early age. And then me being very concerned about my own health, I really got into working out. And uh, when I saw other people in the gym and discovered how healthy they were and the things that they did, did to get there, it really motivated me to take better care of myself. And in turn, I started helping other friends and family members to also live a healthier lifestyle. I started doing bodybuilding uh, competitions some years ago, probably about, uh, about over 12 years ago. And I was able to win several competitions, um, the, the fitness portion and bodybuilding, and it, was, it just turned out to be such a great uh, moment in my life. And investing that time and for myself and for me, it made me just discover who I was and what I really enjoyed doing. I would say uh, my ability to influence women to make major changes in their bodies. And uh, I was able to show women how to transform. And we use that website to show people that how easy it is, that it is possible to take your body from being unhealthy and unfit to a much more fit and healthier shape. So I really have enjoyed that uh, time with working with women and then helping them to discover who they truly are. My philosophy is basically the fit. It's focusing on what you desire for yourself. Um, we're here to help inspire you and you know other women are here to help inspire you to take you along the journey that they've been on and the path that they've been on. And then the T, our transformation, to actually show you who you actually can become. So that has been awesome over the years, working with women to show them how to truly, truly, truly take care of themselves. I've learned that it's much more than just about the fitness. It's also about uh, the mental uh, health and anxiety and pressures that women are going through in life. And so it has become for them, this has become for them, their sanctuary, their area that they can come to together to come together and be themselves and truly enjoy what, how to take care and be there for themselves and for others. I hope to bring in more trainers so that they can start working with younger generations. Right now, the majority of the clients that come here are between the ages of 40 to 60. So what we want to do and our goal for the future is to reach out to women younger, get them involved in taking care of themselves at an earlier age. I feel like what gets me most excited is just being able to help. Being able to help someone that really thought, particularly women maybe with having low self-esteem or some issues, um, that, that being able to help them to actually feel better and be happy. Follow your passion. Um, first of all, it's always passion over paycheck. That's what I tell women. So once you are become very uh, passionate about what you're doing, you tend to put your all into it. And that's what I've done over the years and everything else will come right behind it. So I always tell people, follow your passion. If this is something that you want, I'm here, of course, to help you to understand what the things that it takes. But more than anything at all, just to be able to give. You have to be able to give and people to see that you're there for them and they'll come. The biggest thing that I always talk to women about, is not just about the training, it starts with what you actually put into your body. So my focus with them when they come in the door, we're not talking about the workout and how to do jumping jacks or how to do chest press or anything like that. We're talking about what nutrients they need to put in their body in order to have, because that's the beginning of it. In order to have a fit body, it needs to start with what you are eating. If you'd like more information about this success story or any of those in the past, go to BEOshow.com. Scan the QR code, it'll get you right there. While you're there, look for past segments from the show from each of our seven weekly topics. Watch them, download them, 
share them using the buttons that are all right underneath each piece of video. Also, listen to and subscribe to our Business Equity and Opportunities podcast on the All Indiana Podcast Network. Sign up for the newsletter that we update every Tuesday. And if you have questions or suggestions or a success story to share, send us an email at beo at wishtv.com. Thanks for being with us this morning. We'll have more stories to inform and motivate you next week in Business Equity and Opportunities. Till then, I'm Scott Sander. Have a great day. Business, equity, and opportunities made possible by InnoPower, Bose McKinney and Evans, Gemco, Fifth Third Bank, and Indiana University, Indianapolis. is unique and every business has a target audience circulus digital media can help you connect and grow your customer base with turnkey digital solutions that are nimble to reach a customer base that spans the globe pinpoint a specific audience down to the smallest details no matter the size of your business put circulus digital media to work for you and get results